That's Sarah. No, that's the Terminator. <laughs> that was Sarah. I thought that was Sarah. <laughs> How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel and um, I was doing something a little different today. Um, I'm actually in my girlfriend's cabin, Ioana. You want to say hello, Ioana? Hi! <laughs> <laughs> um, so what we're doing is, um, you've seen pretty much nothing of horror. like Not really, no. Not really, no. no. And like, I mean, I've seen a lot of horrible things in the world, <laughs> you know, like people that watch horror films. Yes. But uh, no, no, not so much not horror so yet. Not so much, yeah. No, so no, no. I love horror, and like the reason I haven't done a whole lot of it on the channel is because I've seen most of the classic films. But I thought this would be a cool way to uh, revisit it, watching it with you. Because before I started the channel, I always loved watching people. Like, I love what reaction channels myself, so seeing you react to these, some of these classic films. That'll be very interesting. Now, guys, I still will be, will be doing my Western reactions and my silent films and Star Trek. All that will still be on the channel. This will be something kind of every once in a while. And I thought, cabin, perfect setting for horror, you know? Yeah. Um, so we decided to watch The Terminator first because The Terminator, to be honest, is not a fully-fledged horror film. Some people would even argue it's not a horror film at all. I think it is. But there is a very much a science fiction um, element to it as well. But just before we get into it, what do you know about the film? Well, I definitely know that it's not a full-on horror film, otherwise I wouldn't be watching it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, you said it was a rom-com, didn't you? Like, the Terminator uh... travels back in time to find his big love. Was it that? No. Mm, um... not, I won't say, I won't say. Well, <laughs> if that's what you want to know, feel like that's what you want it to be going in, then we'll, we'll say it's that. I'd be, I'd, I'd be very disappointed if that's, if that's not the, the main okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, plot okay. of the and movie. Have you seen Arnold and anything else? I've seen him half naked a bunch of time flexing his muscles. Okay. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Remember that? No, I, I may. <laughs> no, I may have seen him in, in Conan. Actually, I think. Okay. Uh, I've actually not seen that one. That was his first. My favorite movie with Arnold. Which is 1990s uh, uh, movie with Danny DeVito. Oh, twins. Yeah. I never knew you've seen twins. Yeah, oh, I, twins. I love oh. twins. Twins yeah, is a brilliant twins. movie. Yeah. Twins is a classic. Yeah. I remember renting that in video years ago. That and Turtles Three. I remember getting my parents who were gone away for a wedding and me and a couple of the brothers, we rented a Turtles Tree and Twins. A weird kind of combo. Oh, you know, but that's an interesting yeah, combo. Worked, but, um, yeah. but yeah, um, I've actually, like the two other main actors in like uh, Linda Hamilton and Michael Bean, I met both of them last year. I think some of you might remember I put a picture up on the channel at Dublin Comic Con. Uh, it was really cool. Um, this Terminator is one of my all-time favorite films, so to meet them was a really, really cool experience. Uh, but yeah, with that said, uh, will we crack on and get into Terminator? Sure. Sure. Can't okay. wait. Okay. <laughs> That's going to be the nice part of the movie. <laughs> also produced Tur or Robocop. Oh, yeah. Have you seen that one? No. James Cameron directed James Cameron. This. Yeah, he directed Yes, Titanic. I did know that. He I, wrote I did, directed I did, this. I did, I did know that. Yeah. That I knew. 2029, that's in my. Yeah, they both five, five years. years. I know, it's crazy. <laughs> Ugh. Bunch of skulls. Machines rose from the ashes. What year? Tonight. I love that. What a perfect setup. So ages. Mm -hmm. Do you know who originally was supposed to play Terminator? Or who was. Uh, I'm getting an idea. Like OJ Simpson. No. <laughs> He's might have said. No one would believe him as a killer. No. Oh no! <laughs> Female Terminator. Yeah. Fetal, that's German as well, mm -hmm. isn't it? Should, should uh, clarify, although you were born in Romania, you've lived, lived in Germany for quite a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly, which is perfect. Yeah, it's like, like, it's like, kind uh, of like these little things that they hit. Like the motif almost. Yeah. Right. Literally hitting the metal. Yes, yeah, you know, exactly. Right? Yeah, 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 just yeah, how clever. it works. It's very good. Yeah. Oh god, it's that moment when like something <laughs> lands or something <laughs> happens, and I don't even know if look, the wind's coming in. The film's in the Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Talking about him being good. I know, I was thinking that my hand was good. Looks like he, he did go to the gym a couple of times, mm. doesn't it? You know, like, Hey, my turn. A lot of English fellas would have had that haircut in the 90s. Mm. Is he still naked? Yeah. Go, Arnie. Nice night for a walk. <laughs> Wash day tomorrow. Nothing clean, right? Your clothes. Give them to me. Now. 
Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> what did he grab? His liver? His heart? His heart, I think. Oh. He ripped something out anyway. Yeah, I think that's the right move. I've just seen that. Like, just do whatever he wants. Okay. What? Who's that now? It's like the guy that's gonna rescue someone. Also, why do these people time travel naked? Like, is it like clothes don't travel, or yeah. like what they probably they don't have the one? They were just like, wait, we have to have Schwarzenegger naked, but therefore this fella has to be naked as well. He doesn't look too bad, so that's all good. Hold it right there! It's rabbiting. Hey, I said hold it! But also, they didn't catch Schwarzenegger, but they, they want to catch this fella. I suppose they just didn't happen to see Schwarzenegger when he appeared, you know. Also oh yeah. What day is it? The date? 12. May. Thursday. What year? Is there like a bunch of clothes there? Oh yeah, of course there is. That's good. So he looks he looks less conspicuous. What's the word? Conspicuous. conspicuous. Thank you. I'm native English yeah. speaker and you have to correct me. <laughs> 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 Our product placement for you. <laughs> oh, those are nice yeah. sneakers. Classics. This is just adrenaline and he's probably a fit man yeah. as well. Yeah. Wait. He still knows how to use a cell phone? Well, no, no, like, not a cell phone, like a phone. I wonder who that is. <laughs> I'm gonna go out on a limb and think that maybe Sarah Connor, let's say someone from 2025, you know, like yeah. that, that, that's still struggling with something like a phone book. Yeah. Imagine a Generation yeah. Z yes. person with yeah. a phone book. They're like, yeah. it's like, what does this contraption work? I think that's mine, but I didn't know what to try. Who beef? Mine's the chili beef deluxe. Okay, who gets the burly beef? Man. Uh. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> Sarah, not such a great waitress. <laughs> this isn't real leather, is it? Uh-uh. Oh, shit. Yeah. Look at this way. In a hundred years, who's gonna care? Nobody has taught him uh, any manners. So yeah. just... <laughs> also, how do they know which one's the right one? Or is that going to be part of the whole thing? That's it. No, no, please don't tell me he's gonna kick the dog into the sun. Arakana? Yes. <laughs> She's too old. Once again, Sarah Connor, 35, mother of two, brutally shot to death in her home this afternoon. You're dead, honey. Uh, isn't that supposed to be the future? Oh, that is the future. <gasps> really just blown to bits. Oh no. Oh, okay. Well, there it is. Hmm? Typical 80s Sorry. haircuts. Uh. First, I'm gonna rip the buttons off your blouse one by one. And then slowly pull your jeans off, inch by inch. Is that for her or her girlfriend? Ginger, it's mad! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Who is this? Sarah? <laughs> Hello? For summer of the buttons off your blouse. <laughs> Over again. <laughs> oh, look at that for 80s. <laughs> Brilliant. My dad had a haircut like that in the 80s. <laughs> Back in Romania. Like, it was good. They, they actually had perms and they, they claimed they had a splash of shampoo and <laughs> admit that they all had perms. It was very funny. <laughs> Get out of it. Look, I'm really sorry. I'll, I'll make it up to you. Call you in a day or so, okay? Oh, it was her boyfriend, was mm. it? Um. Shitty boyfriend, was it? Yeah. And herself with her little scooter. Oh, that's him. Or in the apartment manager's now. Call her. I just called. Her. Call her again. Talking to a machine, but don't be shy. It's okay. Machines need love. Uh oh, I'm seeing bad things coming. Is she seriously listening to music while he's? <laughs> that appears to be. <laughs> Are virtually identical. Is she actually going out for herself now? Two hours ago, 35-year-old Sarah Aww. Ann Connor was pronounced dead at the scene in her... 
people she wants to look at which one she is. Mm. Just the, uh -oh. She's killed two of them, so I think she's the last one uh -oh. in that region. It's always great when you're being followed by a guy in a French card. <laughs> Terminator. There he is. He's got to finish off the flatmate, isn't he? I've just not got to hear him because. Still in her earphones. Yeah. That... So he must have had a good session to get that picture. Ah! Happens to be the flatmate of Sarah and just living in the firing line, you know? Mm. Of he probably assumes it's Sarah. Why does she call her flatmate and not repeat? She did call for, for uh, the police earlier, but, but they were all the lines were busy. busy. Yeah, yeah, she said she's going to give them another try. Oh, shit. That's what she looks like. Listen carefully. You're in a public place, so you'll be safe till we get there, but stay visible. Don't go outside or even to the restroom. Oh! <gasps> How does he get there so fast? <laughs> hey, what's the other fast guy? driver. <laughs> Whoa! Thank God. She just went down. She knocked the bottle of drink off the table. I should have said bending over is Well, he's a machine, like, but yeah. he's uh, so he still can be at least slightly incapacitated. Yes, he can be, yeah, yeah, yeah. The shots are powerful, so they're doing nothing more. Well done. Come with me if you want to live. Come on, Sarah. Alright. So, from, from Terminator's yeah, yeah, perspective, perspective yeah, it's cool. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, oh. Yeah, we'll get the views! Which is. See? His eyebrows burned off and the fire is singed. Oh, right. It's such a cool effect, it was just smoke emanating. Yeah, that's Sarah, it's not exactly in a. In a in a good position right now, or she, she, she's no, like... She's no idea what's going on. Astro, Sarah, okay, now you can freak out. Now you can freak out. Do exactly what I say! Exactly! Don't hurt me! <laughs> How does she... Why does she think that he would hurt her? Like, he literally saved her life! Nail 19. Westbound and Olympic approaching over the... Mimicking the class voice. The Terminator's an infiltration unit. Part man, part machine. Underneath it's a hyperalloy combat chassis, but outside it's living human tissue. Flesh, skin, hair, blood grown for the cyborgs. They cannot make things like that yet. Not yet. Not for about 40 years. Right. <laughs> cyborgs don't feel pain. I do. Oh, look, she wouldn't want full Transylvania. <laughs> <laughs> it just hadn't bloody and everything. It doesn't feel pity or remorse or fear, and it absolutely will not stop until you are dead. It's a lot to take in. <laughs> Jesus. Why me? Why does it want me? All this. This whole place. Everything. It's gone. That close to going out forever. But there was one man who has to fight to storm the wire of the camps. To smash those metal motherfuckers into junk. His name is Connor. John Connor. Your son, Sarah. Whoa. Now it's gonna be interesting. If you wanna have like a mind fuck future film moment. Mm -hmm. I 
eyes are so intent. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Sort of retroactive abortion? <laughs> That's an interesting <laughs> term. <laughs> Skynet had to wipe out his entire existence. Is that when you captured the lab complex and found that? The time displacement equipment? The Terminator had already gone through. Connor sent me to intercept and they blew the whole place. How are you supposed to get back? I can't. Oh. One eye now. Oh, God. <laughs> you thought it was over. Of course it wasn't over. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know like it wasn't. Whoa. But still looks cool though. Well. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Thinks he's there as well? <laughs> sure. Every good machine man will. You still don't get it, do you? He'll find her. That's what he does! That's all he does! He'll wait for you, reach down her throat, and pull her fucking heart out! Doc. So Reese is crazy. In technical terminology, he's a loon. Sarah I'm wearing one under his coat. Feel that? Yeah, because that's gonna help her against mm. the Terminator. I think he said it like that's probably what she yeah, saw. How he survived when when we shot. Ah, oh, like I thought. Are... I'm a friend of Sarah Connor. I was told that she's here. Could I see her, please? No, can't see her. She's making a statement. Like, there's not one trend why this guy's wearing I'll shades. Back. It's the line. Watch him. Yeah, because that's the thing. Him, is it? Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. Yeah. What's interesting is that earlier she asked Reese, can you stop them? I said, I said, with these weapons, I don't know. Cops fired a lot of rounds at him and he just kept coming, you know. Saying that weapons in the future will have been designed to cause more impact, I'd yeah. say. Probably destroy Terminators. I think you'll be able to download an app to <laughs> I've, I've no Wi Fi, I've no um, um, connection. Reese, you got a first name. Kyle. You mean you got shot? That's not bad. Well, we gotta get you to a doctor. That's okay, forget it. Where did you get shot? Take this off. Look in the air. Good easy way to get a guy on Jeff though. Jesus. God, take this off! <laughs> and the other thing. And your puns. <laughs> it's about my height. Uh oh. It's not her son, is it? He. He has your eyes. Is that Sarah's son? Yeah. What's he like? No. He, this guy is not he her trust son. Him. Oh, I'm not saying it's got a strength. I'd die for John Connor. Or is he her grandson? Oh, was it John that sent you here? I volunteered. It was a chance to meet the legend. Sarah Connor. Come on, do I look like the mother of the future? Probably. 
can't even balance my checkbook. There are no checkbooks in the future. <laughs> Your son gave me a message to give to you. You must be stronger than you imagine you can be. You must survive or I will never exist. Also, would you see the nipples? Very often featured in, like, underneath the top. <laughs> I didn't you said. Very often. I've watched this film, like, so many oh, times and never noticed that. That's what you said. <laughs> Well, there it is. Here's Sarah Connor. I think they'll be used to <laughs> From an efficiency point of view. Mm. Oh no! I'm thinking it's one of those things where he would have already gone back to the past. Yeah. Would have fallen for her, fathered her baby, somehow ended up back into the future. Yeah, that's an interesting theory, yeah. Again, I can't say anything, but yeah, that's that's definitely an interesting um, hunch. But now it's interesting. How would the Terminator now figure out where they are? That's just rotting away. Oh yeah. Hey, buddy. There's always one of those fellas. Yeah. George. 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 Yeah. Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> the option came in for you know the options like yes, no. Damn. Damn. I'm kind of getting a bit obsessed with those shoes now. I may have to check them out later. <laughs> They've got on a good Alright. With the kitchen. Do you have one with the kitchen? The thing is that he has her diary. Because he, he was looking through mom's right. cabin. So he probably... We should check your bandage too. Later. I'm going out for supplies. Why did he say he needed a kitchen? Um, I think it's a city one. That one with a kitchen. Oh, she's talking to someone. Here's the number. Ready? Yes. Go ahead. What happened to the lizard? Oh, she listening in again. I love you too, sweetheart. Oh no! I forgot about that, didn't you? The voice. Yeah. Came. What do we got? Mothballs. He's gonna build a bomb, isn't he? He's doing the MacGyver. <laughs> he needs he needs some chewing gum now. It's the eighties. He's got the blonde hair like him. Yeah. You'd be getting hangry at this stage. I'd you? be like I'd be able to kind of <laughs> probably kill the Terminator at this stage. You know, don't give me any food in <laughs> twenty four hours. You know, and you're like <laughs> probably like drained from all of the crap. You'll never be over, will it? What did you say? Will it never be over, will it? The women in your time. What are they like? Good fighters. That's not what I meant. Was there someone special? No. Never. I suppose the world he grew up in, like, you know, might have had an opportunity. John Connor gave me a picture of you once. I didn't know why at the time. It seemed just a little sad. I used to always wonder what you were thinking at that moment. I came across time for you, Sarah. I love you. I always have. Is that like future Tinder? You just get like one actual picture and you go, I love her. Also, she did the, the ultimate line. Women, what are they like? <laughs> oh, look, she's got her boobs out. You don't have to edit that. Oops. Great places! that she handled the explosive sticks. <laughs> Terminator, Terminator. He's 
in a bad way. She is in a bad way. She's in a very bad way. <laughs> that guy's already dead, isn't he? Let's get out of here. Get out. It's all right. Don't ask me twice. Seriously? Well, that does not like a good plan. This guy, how is he even able to run? Oh, that's clever. Mm -hmm. Match it away. She's actually getting close to it. We did it, Kyle. We got it. Well done, Kyle. Oh no. No, 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 no. Now he's the full on fucking robot. Man! Red eyes. Oh, for God's sake. Now you're in proper horror territory now. Like, that's, uh, that's stop motion, but. I know you tell it's not real, real but it still looks really creepy. Oh, it Doesn't does. it? No. It looks, like, it looks abnormal. Huh? What happened to him? He's not shot, he's just. On your feet, soldier! On your Bad look there, don't but that's how to kill him. Run! Run! Sure. Guns don't do anything. Did it do it? Did it? Did it? Did it? To her. Oh, she fell on her leg is back. Is that worried? I don't know if you should pull it out though, wouldn't that make, make it worse? It, yeah, yeah, it would because it's bleeding. Start bleeding then, yeah. Well, no, yes, it did. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Oh, no. Oh. But you only got to sleep in the woods. <gasps> no! Since it's half a thing, it's even quicker. Right, isn't it? Yeah, it's like the... just like the torso. <laughs> Did that. <laughs> I still see the red light, the red light, the red light, the red light. Is it going out? Is it going out? Is it going out? Is it going out? Yes! <laughs> you know what I would do? Yeah. Rip that thing off. Put it on my wall. <laughs> that he, he would have been alive after. But no. Hmm, that's sad. Mm -hmm. I can get it straight. She's pregnant, isn't she? Boy, that's a tough one. Will it affect your decision to send him here, knowing that he is your father? If you don't send Kyle, you can never be. God, a person could go crazy thinking about this. I suppose I will tell you. I owe him that. We loved a lifetime's worth. Mira, Mira! Hold on. <laughs> He said there's a storm coming in. I know. <laughs> cool. It's a good film, isn't it? Yeah, it yeah. is. It is, it is, it is, it is. Rice, that was The Terminator. Uh, I'll huh. be back.
<laughs> <laughs> Maybe even on this channel. Yeah, yes, <laughs> and, very good. You know, yes. like that was that, exactly. that was, yeah, very absolutely. Athlete, very aptly put. Yes. But um, what were your so what were your thoughts on the film? Like, what, what did you think of it? Well, as I said, it was a rom com. <laughs> I had the guy wrong. <laughs> it wouldn't have been the Terminator that came back for her, but it was this other guy. Yeah, you know. So technically, but, no. But, right. but no, but you're right. There is definitely like a um a romance element to yeah, it. Like, there, is, there is a love story yeah. to it. Like you know. He's... Yeah, let's call it that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, future Tinder. <laughs> but, <laughs> It's like in the future <laughs> when all of the dating apps have disappeared. <laughs> but you know what's interesting though, because like, some people don't pick up on this. Some do, like, but like that picture that he had of her. Mm -hmm. If you remember, he says, um, you know, John Connor gave me this photo uh, of you years ago, and he said, "I always, you always looked a little sad. I always wondered what you were thinking in that moment." And if you see at the very end, the kid who takes the picture of her. She was literally thinking of Kyle. Of, of, yeah. That's what she was thinking of. Like, that is, that's yeah. actually a very clever yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's, that's a she very was thinking clever of him, thing. Like, yeah. you know. yeah. but, um, Destiny can go a funny way through the times and everything. Yeah. <laughs> but you kind of, I think, did you have, like you have predicted that first. You said like you thought that he might be the father. And you were saying you thought he'd be Sarah's grandson. Yeah, yeah. So you were kind no, of what I was like, no, no. So, yeah, but yeah. that was just because like after the, uh, but I was like, Nah, they wouldn't do that. Yeah. They would have like the, there has to be like some sort of a like a sexual component between the two of them, you know. So that was already picked up from picked the beginning. Up, yeah. Otherwise, they would have picked a much less attractive main couple. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, yeah, no. So that was good. But it's what I find interesting about these films, mm. you know, or as you would put it, films. <laughs> I, not You're like... not the only one. A lot of them in the comments have pointed out to me. I said films, films. Yeah, I'll, I'll probably start calling it that soon. Myself. <laughs> um, no, but like, it's, what I find interesting is that thought that everything came like from the future, right? Mm. So like he came from the future, but yeah. how, like, it's a bit like the chicken and the egg, you mm -hmm. know, like, what if, like, that wouldn't have been him. It would have been someone else. Like, oh, like, you know what I mean? Like, happened, like is it same, the first time it happened because right, or right, Reese is actually younger than John. So yeah. there has to be, a t yeah, my brother talked about this to me before, saying that there must have been a certain timeline where John's father was someone else yeah. originally. Because yes. Otherwise, it's kind of like it doesn't yeah, add up. Yeah, it can't add up. Yeah, yeah. so I, I think that's what, there was, must have been some, a certain timeline where someone else was John's father. Unless, you know, there are, there are actually a lot of, like, philosophical uh, ideas about time actually being circular. Okay. You know, so, like, we think of it as, like, uh, mm. sort of straightforward mm -hmm. but actually a lot of people say no no time is actually circular okay. and in, if like if you believe in that particular philosoph mm -hmm. uh, philosophical idea that would actually work out somehow okay yeah but however i don't think that the writers of the movie would have thought about that <laughs> <laughs> like no but it was it was a cool it was a cool 80s movie yeah. as i said it's i find it interesting because i haven't watched many 80s movies mm. in a long time now yeah. um just to kind of look at the production of it and yeah. uh you know it's the, quite great yeah. quite um uh but i think it, it that goes in his favor it's a small budget but it kind of it has a um rough around the edges what, it. was it a small budget it was well like it wasn't massive budget i know the second one has a much enormous higher budget. budget yeah this one was quite small budget but i this is my favorite one the friday the first one is the best a lot of people think the second one is the best but i think this one it's it's kind of darker and edgier um like we might we might watch the second one oh yeah, yeah, yeah that would be interesting. a lot of people love the second one so we could Sarah watch that. Connor in that one yeah, she's back in that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. she's yeah. back too. She's back. Yeah, I mean, Sarah's back. We will have to be back. But do you know what's interesting? Like, we were talking about Arnold, and like he was really good as that kind of. He, he, he was just, brilliant. He was like he has very. He's very very good at it. Yeah, he was. But but um, James Cameron originally they, the producers wanted him wanted them or wanted James to cast Arnold as Reese. And he was like, he was like, no, I don't want. No, to. he's too massive. For yeah, that. He was, and also I think the accent wouldn't have worked. Yeah, but but also he, you know? I, I think he touched thought like, look, I'm not saying Arnold's a bad actor or anything, but you probably needed a little more range to play Reese. There's a, you know, he's a bit more of a grounded character. And James uh, James Cameron said that they were having an interview with, with or uh, he was gonna have a meeting with Arnold, and he was thinking like, God, I have to pick a fight with Arnold Schwarzenegger about to get him out of wanting to do the film. But when they actually talked, all Arnold was talking was, yeah, the Terminator should do this, the Terminator should do that. And oh, Arnold so himself and then... wanted to play right. the Terminator. So he was like, oh, you'd be brilliant as a Terminator. So it worked out perfectly, like, you know. 
Yeah, because um, I, I wouldn't have seen Arnold like play Reese. Yeah. Because what guy, you would have had to find an even more massive like a, guy to play. Like the Terminator. I mean, yeah. who would have, like Lou yeah. Frigno or like yeah. who would have played the Terminator? <laughs> and then you have this weird Terminator with like a, like an Austrian accent, mm. you know, and uh, there's this whole uh, idea about Austrians, you know, like them traditionally not be the good guys. Okay. <laughs> and like, you know, like historically and otherwise. <laughs> so there is kind of like that image to it. But, so. but it's it's great because you can't imagine anyone else really playing him. No, no, like, he was really he good. Was really good for yeah, it, he like. was really good. And it, sorry, sorry, come on. Yeah, no, no, but it was. I think it was. It was kind of fun, and it, it worked out really well. Mm. Um. So uh, yeah. Also, as a storyline, you know, like as a kind of like an origin <laughs> story, also for mm. Sarah Connor. Yeah. Because that was her origin story, yeah, right? Like basically, if she yeah. Returns, yeah. Yeah. No, definitely. And yeah. like as you saw towards the end, like she really does grow and become. You can see traces of the obviously the figure she's going to become in the future, like where she's oh, yeah. you know, um, encouraging Reese, like yeah. you're on your feet, soldier, you know, she's taking she charge, becoming it, a leader, yeah. yeah. Yeah, because at the beginning she was, I'm not sure I, I, I bought, you know, that sort of development within this short amount of mm. time, but then again, who would actually get into such an extreme, mm. like you would never be in that, type of situation, situation so yeah. maybe if you were in that situation where everything was so condensed yeah. and you're like yeah, you would in lost. fact do yeah. that you know yeah. like you, it is kind of like the yeah. the, the the survival mode yeah. that kicks in so Definitely. she would have she would have and, and, and like to be fair to her as well like you, know, you see kind of what she goes to at the start like just other Sarah's getting killed her friend gets murdered like all and then like you're told oh yeah you have to survive because your son becomes the one man who mm -hmm. gives us a chance of stopping him in the future so you all this in the space of a day I guess last like for anyone that's a lot to take like you know yeah it is um so yeah it is interesting how then she develops towards the end yeah um, and then she's like she's she's a proper hard ass in the end oh yeah like, yeah, yeah definitely so, like, yeah like she has to she good. has to go for it, like yeah. yeah but like you, you can see you now what like what i was saying like how elements of it definitely have a horror feel to it yeah oh yeah especially yeah. the last one yes towards you know, the end with, the, with the a machine, like... yeah yeah exactly and the, the stop motion yeah. um effects that they use uh but uh, no, I'm glad now you enjoyed it because I turned yeah, it. Yeah, it was fun. It's one it of my fun. favorite films. Really good. Um, so look, we yeah. might do another one in the future. Oh yeah, yeah, no, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be back. We'll be back. <laughs> we'll be back. Yeah. But like you said, we will do horrors, but we could do like other films as well. Like there's a lot of good films you haven't seen. Like Stand by Me, my favorite film of all time. That's one we should definitely watch at some point. Robots in that one. Uh, no, no, no <laughs> robots in that one. Uh, but it's based on a uh, short story by Stephen King, but it's not a horror. Okay. Our, yeah, All right. Our, um, but yeah. But guys, uh, we hope you enjoyed the reaction. And uh, until next time, slong fall. Slong, motherfuckers. <laughs>